this study involves a fuzzy inventory classification system design and application in telecommunication sector that is obtained by the comparison of two methods for inventory classification. Seeking for an alternative method for inventory control is arise because of the weakness of ABC classification system. Fuzzy clustering C means method suggests a solution for this weakness. For 45 stock items of a telecommunication company, ABC and C means methods are applied separately. Finally, results are compared in terms of stack clusters and numbers. There are thousands of stock items in inventory management system. To control all stock items in same level is meaningless and very difficult. To determine to what extent the various stock items in stock to control, they should be classified according to their criticality or value. ABC analyzes stock items under three groups, A, B and C. Class A has the highest financial volume, not in the auto purchasing process, consists of close control required items. Items in this class forms 80% of the stock investment, but constitutes 20% of the total number of parts. Class B has the middle financial volume, being in the auto purchasing process, belongs to the authority of the management. Items in this class forms 30% of the stock investment, but constitute 15% of the total number of parts. Class C has the lowest financial volume, are in the auto purchasing process. Items in this class forms 50% of stock investment, but constitute 5% of the total number of parts. Class A items are tracked tightly, data is saved properly, safety stock levels, level is low and are reviewed continuously in small quantities. On the other hand, Class B items are tracked normally, data is also saved properly, safety stock level is middle and are reviewed occasionally in middle quantities while Class C items are tracked simply, data is saved also simply, safety stock level is high and are reviewed periodically in high quantities. According to ABC operating procedure, annual sum is calculated by multiplication of usage and price for each item. Then each sum is turned to the percentages. Percentages are ranked from highest to lowest. Afterward, classes are decided in terms of cumulative. However, recommended class distinction points not only fractional, but also not together in the same row. So the distinctions depends on the decision maker's subjectivity. Some attach importance to financial cumulative, while others care quantity. Financial cla for class A and quantity for class C for instance. Furthermore, the decision dislocates next cluster boundary. In addition, some could increase or decrease class number. C means method could be an option which loads subjective decision to an autonomous algorithm that artificial neural network based. When the algorithm is finalized, the points in p-dimensional space takes the form a spherical shape which are clusters. These clusters are assumed to be approximately at the same size. The class centers represent each cluster and are called prototypes. 
As a measure of distance, it uses the Euclidean distance between the center of the clusters and the data. The objective function of the clustering method is a weighted least squares function. The parameter n is the number of observations, c indicates the number of clusters. If the function to be minimized for each value of c, in other words, first order derivative of an e equalized to zero, is the prototype of the algorithm. SSC Telecommunication Company desires to analyze its 45 stock items by ABC and uh, versus fuzzy Siemens method. ABC is performed on Excel while C means is performed on NCSS 10 software package. C means proposes more sensitive results which eliminate antecedents. Although results indicate that there is little difference both in stock number and annual usage, even one item's cluster is important when the amount is worthy or when the quantity is critical. When comparing to ABC, in C means results, two items are added to A clusters, one item from cluster B and cluster C are decreased. ABC results seems to keep 80 to 20 rule, while C means is concluded 88 percentage rule in amount usage. Thanks for listening.